Yo, what's going on guys? It's your boy. Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be reacting to the Acolyte trailer. Um, For people who do not know, I'm going to give a quick rundown. The Acolyte is an upcoming Star Wars original TV show that's going to be on Disney+. Plus. And uh, there's a lot of things that I've heard about this that makes me really excited. Um, So I'm going to go ahead and preference this by saying before I get too far into this trailer or this reaction... Um, I am not a very big Star Wars fan, and for the most part, a lot of it is actually just because of how overwhelming the Star Wars franchise to me feels. Um, as somebody who grew up watching Marvel, I spent a lot of time watching a bunch of Marvel movies, a bunch of Marvel shows, all that stuff. Um, and Star Wars was something that, like, I didn't start getting into until recent years. And, um, Star Wars has just has so much content, so many TV shows, so many movies, and so much stuff that's been really hard for me to get into it. But I feel like this show looks like it's going to be the perfect show for somebody who, like me, wants to get into newer Star Wars content, but doesn't know where to start um the basic premise for this show is it's taking place a hundred years before any known star wars content up to this point it's before the prequel series it's before the obi-wan kenobi show it's before all of that and um i'm very very excited about it because i believe this show is supposed to be showcasing the dark side and kind of some of the earliest like traces of the dark side in history and i'm pretty sure we're supposed to be watching it from the uh, sith lords the uh, evil people's perspective and then on top of that, I've heard rumors, I don't know if this is true or not yet, that this is going to be a rated R show. And it's going to be uh, one of the darkest things that Star Wars has done. So that being said, I'm incredibly excited for this trailer. We're going to dive right into this. And here we go. Close your eyes. Your eyes can deceive you. We must not trust them. I feel like that's a good message. Tell me what comes into your mind. These are young Jedis, right? Life. I'm pretty sure. Balance. Yeah, they're younglings. Okay. I see fire. Go. Oh, I'm so excited for action sequences with the Force. Someone is killing Jedi. It doesn't make sense. Well, what happened? I sensed the darkness. Oh my God, I love that so much. Isn't about good or bad. Oh this my god, those visuals are great. And who is allowed to use it? What is that? The... Damn, that was a very short trailer. But that being said, there's probably going to be more trailers um, at some point. Um, this show is coming out in June, which uh, surprisingly is like right around the corner. Um, like uh, this month is going, not this month, this year is going by really fast for me. Um, okay, key moments that I really want to talk about. For one, that first showing of the red lightsaber, saber, pretty dope. I like that they're not really going to give us too much about like who it is who's behind the red lightsaber. Like we kind of have ideas based off of um, other parts of the trailers, obviously. But um, I really like the fact that they're showing... There are like seven or eight people going up against this person with the red lightsaber and they are so much more powerful and that's the power of the dark side. That's cool. That's amazing. Um, The visual effects look fantastic. This little spaceship, we only see a little bit of it, but um, that's one thing that I'm really excited for. Uh, I've watched Rogue One for the first time a couple weeks ago and um, all of the like stuff with like the dog fights and everything are really cool and I really want to kind of see more of that in Star Wars. So um. I, I'm very looking forward to some of the stuff like that. Overall, these hand-to-hand -hand combat scenes look really, really good. I like the idea, like the co just concept of somebody um, using a tiny little dagger. I don't think I've ever seen anybody use like just a regular weapon in a Star Wars content before. That being said, like I said, I haven't seen a lot of Star Wars things. Like I've only watched the beginning of the Clone Wars. I think I've seen like the first like season, give or take. And then uh, I've watched the majority of the movies. I haven't watched any of the sequels, uh, but... That being said, everything so far looks really good. I really like uh, the the scenery. Like this planet with all the like fog and everything in the background looks great. Or I guess it's like snowy. Um, and then like this shot, 
everything looks fantastic. Uh, what's it called? The volume is something that has kind of been getting like critiqued a lot in Hollywood recently. And if this is filmed on the volume, I think that they've done a really good job with this because everything so far in this trailer, at least, looks fantastic. When we're seeing like the big scope of things, everything looks realistic. It doesn't look like flat, like a lot of things recently have. Um, but that being said, uh, I'm not, I'm not going to get too far into this trailer because like I said, I don't know a lot about the Star Wars lore or anything, uh, but it looks pretty solid from this. Uh, I kind of wish this trailer gave us a little bit more, but that being said, there's still plenty of time for us to kind of have more of an idea of what this show is going to be. Um, but that being said, it looks all right. Like I, I, it's kind of got my attention a little bit. Um, there's nothing really jaw dropping or anything about this though. So that being said, uh, that was it for this little video trailer reaction. Uh, thank you guys so much for coming by and checking it out. I love and appreciate you guys so much for watching. No, 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 if you liked it, no, no, feel free to like and subscribe, no, no, and I will hopefully no, 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 see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Back at it again, but that's irrelevant. Flow so smooth, they calling me Mr. Elegant. Like an elephant, I got a long nose. Like a president, I've got a few hoes. Swift with a stutter, I'm smooth like butter. Don't see it coming when I slip undercover. Like a big dog, but I don't bite. I'm still a big broad, I'd win that fight. Come match you and I knock out your l l lights.